I am Paul Atoll from PaulAtoll.com and in this uh, video I uh, will explain how you can um, upgrade your uh, wrappers uh, to make it compatible with uh, uh, OS uh, X 10.11 El Capitan El Capitan and um, I'm going to show you a little bit uh, more about the porting kit which will uh, replace my uh, my wrappers. Um, I came this uh, came to this idea a while back uh, when I was thinking about uh, the wrappers that um, there will be a time that I can't maintain every wrapper uh, separately. So um, I uh, came across with uh, Vitor, and uh, Vitor uh, in the Miranda is. Um, uh, a buddy of mine which uh, uh, which created a porting kit for me and um, and porting center and those both uh, projects uh, um, well will replace in the end uh, all the wrappers because uh, uh, all wrappers are well at the moment like 50 to 200 MB each wrapper and uh, or even bigger and this uh, little script will do exactly the same uh, with uh, creating a wrapper and um, downloading automatically one tricks and much more um, and will do exactly the same if you would download uh, the wrapper uh, separately so that's why um, the porting kit was uh, called to life well, um, the porting kit is also now a tool where you can um, upgrade your old wrappers to make it compatible with uh, with El Capitan. So that's an awesome feature which is uh, implanted into the uh, the porting kit, and um, I'm gonna show you a little bit how this works. Um, first of all, it's my website, Polistolicam where you can uh, uh, download uh, the porting kit, free porting kit, it's free and um, um, the porting kit is also available on uh, theportingkit.com uh, itself also a website of mine um, I created separately or I host it separately uh, 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 to uh, Polytolicom, which is a community for games and uh, and news, and um, the porting kit is only for the the program itself with uh, with the porting kit in a porting center, so you can download both programs on the porting on a download button here. So um, if you don't own the porting kit yet, I would really recommend to use this to uh, play your uh, Windows game on your Mac click on the download button here to download the porting kit or download on my website using uh, the link on here it's the same link so um, if you have the porting kit downloaded which is uh, will be this icon double click it and it will open the porting kit Starting with my uh, website as the home page for news. On the library, there's uh, um, two tabs the local tab with all your games installed, and the server tab with all the games available and where ports are, uh, uh, which you can download. The blue ones are the free ones, and the other ones um, are games. Uh, well, it's a script which will install a specific version of the game, the GG.com version, or um, the Gamesgate version. Well, this in this case is only the uh, the Gamesgate version, uh, the GG.com version. I think here uh, is also the Gamesgate version available. Um, but this uh, video is specifically about. Uh, upgrading uh, wrappers so how to do that is you go to your local tab of uh, the porting kit 
you click here the add application button and um, then you search for a game which need to be upgraded like for example when I go to um, here games so I'm gonna show you it has this problem which you'll probably recognize if you double click the the game in El Captain which worked fine in um, in Yosemite it uh, doesn't work here in uh, El Capitan so you get this miserable message so this is one of the reps which have a problem so what you do is you go to the add button in the uh, pointing kit on the local library tab as you can see here local and you go to um, well insane I did insane here we are and you click on open <coughs> it will add the game into the porting kit as you can see here if you click on a play you will see what happened outdated rubber your rubber at version 2.5.h but the most recent version 2.6.1 so do you want to update it you click yes and if you do that it will um, fix the the issue for you without needing to do anything so that's an awesome feature and it will launch it automatically as well you'll see now it will launch this is a game with uh, lots of uh, <laughs> resolution changing so uh, Whoa, this is hard. Loud music. As you can see, it works. Well, let's do another one. For example, um, Medal of Honor, Allied Assault. And what do we get here? Mop error message. Well, that's sad. Well, let's go to Add Application. And we go to Medal of Honor, and we click Open it, and we click on Medal of Honor, Allied Assault, Play. Ah, yes, we do that. Do -do -do -do. And there it will launch. Yeah, simple as that. And um, it also means if you want to launch the game separately again, well, no problem. The game is fixed, so why not? See, it works fine. And this way you can. Uh, This way you can uh, play your uh, good old uh, games again. This is in Dutch for the ones who don't uh, understand what it says. German checkpoint, 200 yards. Okay, squad, listen up. This is a rescue mission. So watch the fire, and don't give your position away. Advance some cover and check your corners. Well, nice stop. Well, thank you for watching. I hope to see you back on Polotol.com. If you love the work you can always donate on the website and then become a premium member uh, of, uh, of this website and um, support our hard work. 
So uh, spread the word and see you back on apolladetool.com or thepoddingkit.com. Bye-bye.